The following is from Joshua chapter 814 through chapter 825. A complete non-stop reading. Joshua 814. So about 5,000 men were assigned to lie in ambush between Bethel and Ai, west of the city. Joshua 815. Joshua and all Israel let themselves be driven back before them, and they fled toward the wilderness. Joshua 816. All the men of Ai were called to pursue them, and they pursued Joshua and were lured away from the city. Joshua 817. Not a man remained in Ai or Bethel who did not go after Israel. They left the city open and went in pursuit of Israel. Joshua 818. Then the Lord said to Joshua, Hold out toward Ai the javelin that is in your hand, for into your hand I will deliver the city. So Joshua held out toward the city the javelin that was in his hand. Joshua 819. Then the men in ambush rose quickly from their position, and as soon as he stretched out his hand, they ran and entered the city and captured it. They quickly set the city on fire. Joshua 8.20 When the men of Ai looked back and saw the smoke of the city rising up into the sky, they had no chance to escape in any direction. The Israelites who had been fleeing toward the wilderness had turned back against their pursuers. Joshua 8.21 when Joshua and all Israel saw that the ambush had taken the city, and that smoke was going up from it, they turned around and attacked the men of Ai. Joshua 8.22 The men of Ai came out of the city to pursue Israel, and they were trapped in the middle with Israelites on both sides. Israel cut them down, leaving them neither survivors nor fugitives. Joshua 8.23 They took the king of Ai alive and brought him to Joshua. Joshua 8.24 when Israel had finished killing all the men of Ai in the fields and in the wilderness where they had chased them, and when every one of them had been put to the sword, all the Israelites returned to Ai and killed those who were in it. Joshua 8.25 Twelve thousand men and women fell that day, all the people of Ai. Next update, Joshua 8.26-8.35 Please subscribe for update notifications.